the recent volcano eruptions in Hawaii have meant that focus has been increased on the Yellowstone supervolcano. Many have been worrying that these recent explosions could cause increased activity below and above the surface. With all this activity, it has led scientists to speculate that the largest supervolcano in the world might be about to erupt. The Yellowstone volcano is sitting on the Pacific Ring of Fire, and this is what was behind the volcanic activity and earthquake along the Pacific Ocean, the most recent including Hawaii and Indonesia. The geyser at Yellowstone is named the Steamboat, and has been in dormancy since 2014. However, suddenly on the 15th of March it erupted, then again on the 19th of April, the 27th of April and the 4th of May. Specialists have come forward and said that over a period of two weeks more than 200 earthquakes hit Yellowstone, and this told scientists that a huge tectonic plate shift had taken place underneath the surface of the Earth. It was said that due to there being two or three warning signs, there was going to be an eruption. This caused panic when visitors were at the site. These warning signs include seismic activity increasing, an increase of gas outside at the surface and the ground deforming. However, as of today, there has not been any ground deforming, but there has been an increase in the gas outlet and the seismic activity, both under and above the ground surface. Many people have started to get nervous. Seismologists have said that if there was an eruption at Yellowstone, there would be mass destruction. However, experts working at the National Earthquake Information Center don't seem to be worried, and have tried to calm and reassure people. US Geological Survey seismologist Harvey Bent is among those monitoring the site, and said that locals in the region would have lots of warning, and it might be weeks or months before the volcano erupted. It was said the volcano would get more intense in regards to seismic activity, so people would know a long time ahead. If the volcano did erupt, it seems that flowing lava wouldn't be much of a threat. The older Yellowstone lava flows never reach much beyond the park's boundaries, for volcanologists, the biggest worry is the wind-flung ash. The ash would be pretty devastating for the United States. The fallouts would include short-term destruction of Midwest agriculture, and rivers and streams would be clogged by grey mark. However, as mentioned, scientists are not worried about there being an eruption. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.